Good morning everybody, Claire Sharp from Spiritual Pampering here in Yanchet, West Australia. I have been asked by my guides to talk to you about the flame of resurrection, which is associated with a Thursday. It is uh, to do with Master Jesus, Lord Sananda and Mary Magdalene, Lady Nada. So the flame of resurrection is all about bringing up that which needs to be healed. So any blockages to be healed and just really taking something to a higher level, um, resurrecting it um, to be looked at, to be healed and so that we can do the work necessary. So and it's always heightened around the time of Easter. So the time is now that we should all be working with the resurrection flame. And Aurelia Louise Jones, who wrote the Telos teachings, this is the Telos 3 book. Um, and of course, she's got the other book as well, The Seven Sacred Flames. These are really great books if you're looking to move into the fifth dimension. Um, working on the protocols of the fifth dimension is actually, that's what it's actually called. So Aurelia says that the flame of resurrection is another extraordinary tool, among others, which is free and easy to use and is very effective. But unfortunately, it's been forgotten. And uh, so not many people, the majority of people, don't even use this flame. Well, we're supposed to be using it as a, on a daily basis, which is something that I actually do. So, you know, I have my own list. She has her prayer in the book, which I will read to you later. But... I have my own list as well as the ones that she's got. So, you know, we're taught by a dharma. Uh, a dharma is known as the heart doctor, who is the high priest of um, Telos. But a dharma also says, um, also note that around the time of Easter is when the flame is the most active on this planet. This time of year is a window of opportunity to infuse your entire consciousness, being and world with this wondrous flame. It's also when nature is infused by the resurrection flame in greater measure and becomes alive again. Although this flame is active all the time and we should be using it all the time, Easter is when the energy is doubled in intensity for the benefit of mankind in commemoration of the Christ energies brought back to this planet by Lord Jesus, Master, uh, Master Jesus, Lord Sananda. So, you know, bringing it up, so whatever you've got to be healing, healed, you know, you could have ill health. Your finances could be low. This is a great opportunity for really manifesting, bringing up that which needs to be healed with the resurrection flame. And it's so simple to do, so simple to use. I mean, it really is just embodying that flame within you on a daily basis. So I'm going to read to you. An extract uh, of a message from uh, Master Jesus, Lord Sananda, together with Lady Nada, who will, or you'll know as Mary Magdalene. If a dormant bulb lying in the ground through the long winter beneath the snow and ice be stirred into life by the resurrection flame each spring and directs its shoots and flowers through the soil, giving forth beauty and fragrance, it should be a great hope and example to all of you. If a simple bulb can externalise its immaculate concept through the resurrection flame, so can you externalise your mastery. In fact, you can do this in a much greater way. If only you would spend time invoking it daily in your life, for your projects, for your gardens, and for everything you want to create and resurrect. The principle is the same for the bulb as it is for each one of you in your life. Each year around Easter, the flame of resurrection is amplified in a greater measure for over 40 days to create the miracles of spring up for nature. For humans and for all life on the planet, the resurrection flame is also available to the rest, for the rest of the year to everyone to use and invoke. It is a limitless and free for the asking. What better deal could you find on the internet? Did you ever contemplate what makes all of nature suddenly wake up for a new round of beginnings in the spring? Of course, it is the wondrous golden flame. Say now aloud or silently in your heart three times. Now feel the current of hope alive within you. For within your heart you know that there is a seed of divine plan 
and density waiting to burst forth and externalize itself to make each of you step by step a Christed being. This seed in you is by far so much more powerful than the tiny kernel held within the pattern of the crocus or the early violet. And so Adama also says, it's one of the many attributes of God. You can resurrect your finances. You can resurrect your bodies. You can resurrect family harmony. You can resurrect a great number of things you want to ex expand in your life. The resurrection energies are not limited in any way whatsoever. You can use the words I am, knowing that it is unlimited aspect of you. Or you can you could do, do something like, um, from the Lord God of my being, I now call forth to receive now a great infusion of the resurrection flame in every cell, atom and electron of my physical body, my emotional body and all my subtle bodies. I wish to heal and resurrect all aspects of my life. And just name things you personally want to resurrect, such as finance, talents, other things you personally want to resurrect. Harmony. The sky is not even the limit in using this powerful energy. So we're going to use the resurrection flame to bring that, which what you know, what you want to bring up to be healed to create in your life. I mean, this is such a gift that we are given at this time. And the time is now. The time is now. This is what I've been told. And I've been giving it in my dreams and I've been urged to, you know, come on, create this um, a, a video and share with everybody the importance of this very special time of year where the energies are doubled. So, you know, all we have to do is invoke the uh, invoke the um, resurrection flame and bring it into us. So we're going to visualise that flame. So um, it's always helpful to visualise the resurrection flame as a golden, orange, yellowy energy. Luminescent in colour, like you see when you watch the summer su sunset. So make it real, give it life in your heart and mind, because as you visualise it, so it becomes... If you want healing, infuse the problem you want to heal with the wondrous energy and be sure to sustain it long enough to get results. So that's what a Dharma gift tells us. So well, the prayer and invocation to the six rays in the Seven Sacred Flames prayer book. And I'll share that with you in the description. And the way I do it is that I see this and it's like a, this orangey, yellow, golden flame. And I bring it down through my crown chakra, nice and slow, through all your chakras, nice and slow, down to my feet. And then I bring it up and around me. So I'll share the prayer with you as you draw in that beautiful resurrection flame through your crown chakra, through all your chakras. And you say, I am the resurrection and the life three times. And these are just examples of what Aurelia has chosen to put in her prayer. But as I said, you can put anything in your prayer. I am the resurrection and the life. I am the resurrection and the life. I am the resurrection and the life of my perfect health. I am the resurrection and the life. I am the resurrection and the life. I am the resurrection and the life of my finances. I am the resurrection and the life. I am the resurrection and the life. I am the resurrection and the life of the gifts of my divinity. I am the resurrection and the life. I am the resurrection and the life. I am the resurrection and the life of my crystalline matrix. I am the resurrection and the life. I am the resurrection and the life. I am the resurrection and the life of my DNA. I am the resurrection and the life. I am the resurrection and the life. I am the resurrection and the life of my eternal youth and beauty. I am the resurrection and the life. I am the resurrection and the life. I am the resurrection and the life of my perfect work. I am the resurrection and the life. I am the resurrection and the life. I am the resurrection and the life of my heart flame. I am the resurrection and the life. 
I am the resurrection and the life. I am the resurrection and the life of my perfect vision. I am the resurrection and the life. I am the resurrection and the life. I am the resurrection and the life of my perfect relationship. So that prayer can be found on page 49 of the Seven Sacred Flames prayer book. But I've also written my list out. It happens to be on orange paper. I think that's just a fluke. Um... Mine are, so I won't say I am the resurrection and the life. And I'll give you the, I'll give you my, just my statement. So I am the resurrection and the life. And of course we say that three times of my attention and connection to the will of God. I am the resurrection and the life of my ascended master self. I am the resurrection and the life of my true identity in God. I am the resurrection and the life of my spiritual gifts. I am the resurrection and the life of my self-worth and self-value. I am the resurrection and the life of my self-discipline. I am the resurrection and the life of my, self, uh, my focus. I am the resurrection and the life of my determination. I am the resurrection and the life of my friendships. I am the resurrection and the life of my abundance. I am the resurrection and the life of my trust in God. I am the resurrection and the life of my gratitude. I am the resurrection and the life of my acceptance. And today I got this one. I am the resurrection and the life of my perfect balance and harmony in my life. So every day, you know, lots, lots of times I get new ones and I add them to my list. You know, and you can have any aspect. You could have, you know, perfect weight or whatever you want to do, whatever you want. You know, harmony within the family. So that's it. And I just can't stress enough. This is the time we're going to really, really get double amplification if we do the work now. So drawing in that flame through the crown chakra. Cool flame, by the way. OK. And it is the sixth ray. It is the golden orange flame of resurrection. And it is to do, of course, with um, uh, Lord Sananda, which is Master Jesus. And Mary Magdalene, the temple of the resurrection in uh, Jerusalem, associated with the pran uh, pancreas, solar plexus area, uh, third chakra. So lovely to see you all again. Please use the flame. I think you're going to really, really benefit from it. I've been saying it for a couple of years now on a daily basis. And um, yeah, I am the resurrection of the life of all miracles in my life. You know, just whatever unfolds for you so may god bless you and keep you safe with love from my heart to yours this wednesday afternoon take good care and until next time bye bye now